You need three basic pictures to have a stunning thumbnail inside CapCut. One is your background, one is your own picture in PNG file, or you can also change it into PNG or remove the background, don't worry. And CapCut logo or the logo of the app you want to show inside your thumbnail. If you don't know how to remove the background, you can just go to remove.bg and you can remove the background of a picture free of cost by uploading your image here. Go to CapCut and create a new project and import all these three pictures here. Drag them to your timeline. Drag this one to the start and this one to the top. I'm going to leave it here. By staying on your own picture, go, just go to video and now cut out, auto cut out. Now the background has been removed. You just need to do some color grading for your picture. Go to adjustment layer. Here you can choose the brightness, temperature, hue and saturation. If you don't know how to color grade, you can watch my other video in the end screen. I'm going to increase a little bit hue and saturation as well. Highlights, I want to increase. Shadows as well, a little bit. Illumination, a little bit. Brightness, a little bit like this. That's it. I don't want to go for the detailed color grading. Once you're satisfied with your picture, just just adjust it accordingly like this i want to increase the size a little bit here now just bring this CapCut logo i place it here at this place now what you need to do you will go to this place a little pencil icon and you need to remember why i did so because if you go there you can choose only one picture as your background from your local drive you can only choose one picture so you have to make all this thumbnail outside of this cap card so you can choose only one image so that's why i'm not choosing this one all right going to this pencil icon now I go to edit here we have a lot of different templates you can choose from these given templates whatsoever you like it's about food and vlogging and fashion and there are trending one as well let's say i'm gonna choose this one i don't need this information then i can delete this information like simply press delete button bring this one upside here now you can write whatsoever you want i have written my text i can adjust it accordingly like this and you know bring it anywhere on the screen you like you can also rotate this one a little bit and that's it it will look great like this one now by staying on the text you can also go to these bubbles and you want to choose some background like this you can choose any background you like i'm not going to choose any of these backgrounds because that text looks natural you can also give the shadows here change the shadow color change the text color as well and spacing and alignment is already here also go to choose the fonts you like and if you don't know about importing new fonts to CapCut I have separate three videos on it enlarge this text here as well and make sure that you are on the right layer let's say if you want to bring this fire backside then you just need to click on CapCut then it will automatically go to the back layer and if you want to bring this one to the top layer it will work vice versa so just click on the fire like this and now click on cap cut it will go back click on fire it will come in the front once you're satisfied you can just export this one just complete and you can see there is a thumbnail here now if you export this video let's say this is thumbnail and if i export this video now it will export as a folder now i need to go to finder you will see this folder here there is a video and there is a thumbnail as jpeg and it's hd quality you can use it as your video thumbnail anywhere you want so that's pretty much easy if you like this tutorial then thumbs up and subscribe to this channel and if you have any question write in the comment section i always check your comments i'll see you next time bye